Welcome back. And in our top business story, the UAE has been named among the top 10 fastest growing tourism hotspots in 2013. That's according to a new report by the United Nations World Tourism Organization, the UNWTO. The Gulf state registered 10.4% growth in international tourist arrivals last year and was ranked alongside the likes of Russia, China, Turkey and Japan as the best performing cities. Both Dubai and Abu Dhabi have posted record numbers of tourists in 2013. In Dubai, total revenues for the first nine months of the year were up by 17.1%, reaching 15.33 billion dirhams. The report also said that Qatar up 18% and Kuwait up 15% were ranked among the best emerging markets for growth in outbound expenditure. International tourist arrivals to the region grew by 5% in 2013, reaching a record 1,087 million arrivals, according to the latest UNWTO World Tourism Barometer. Despite global economic challenges, international tourism results were well above expectations, with an additional 52 million international tourists travelling the world in 2013. For 2014, UNWTO said it forecasts 4 to 4.5% growth globally. Demand for international tourism was strongest for destinations in Asia and the Pacific, which was up by 6%, Africa up 6%, and Europe up by 5%. Dubai's real estate brokers claimed commissions totaling 1.8 billion dirhams during 2013. That's according to figures released today by the Dubai Land Department. Property intermediaries, companies and individuals registered under RERA, the regulatory arm of the Dubai Land Department, received a standard 2% commission based on the value of the transaction, unless both parties agree on a different amount. Earlier this month, Dubai Land Department announced that the total amount of real estate transactions in Dubai exceeded 236 billion dirhams in 2013, up from 154 billion dirhams in the previous year. Yusuf Al Hashimi, deputy CEO of RERA, was quoted in local reports as saying the impressive figure is mainly due to the optimistic atmosphere among investors, particularly over the past few months adding that no individual or company is permitted to work in real estate brokerage unless they are officially registered with RERA. This mandatory requirement identifies the names of individuals and companies engaged in property brokerage and, the results, and records the rights and responsibilities of all stakeholders in the market. Last month, Knight Frank said Dubai's real estate market is forecast to be the world's top performer in 2014, building on this year's rapid price growth. The Dubai Electricity and Water Authority, or DIWA, has announced an agreement to build a solar power plant in Dubai, signing a memorandum of understanding with Swedish energy technology company Cleanergy and construction firm Alfutheim Karelian for the installment of the Stirling Engine Concentrated Solar Power Plant, or CSP. The installation consists of 10 units with a total capacity of 110 kilowatts. The permit approval process to install the plant has commenced and the installation is expected to be completed by early 2014, according to a statement quoted in local reports. The partnership has been formed to better understand how the CSP technology works in the unique climate conditions of Dubai and to develop a pilot project intended to measure and monitor its performance. The project will then be used as a learning tool for a more large-scale deployment of solar CSP installations in Dubai to help strengthen the local solar industry. The announcement also forms an important part of the Dubai Integrated Energy Strategy 2030 to achieve energy diversification by generating 71% from gas, 12% from nuclear energy, 12% from clean coal and 5% from solar energy. The strategy also aims to reduce demand for energy by 30% in Dubai by 2030. Dubai Holding Chairman Mohammed Abdullah Al Gurgawi has said the company's profits for 2013 are likely to exceed 3 billion dirhams. That's according to statements quoted in a local daily. Speaking from the World Economic Forum in Davos, Gagawi said results were set to double those of the previous year. In a tweet posted by the Dubai Media Office, Gagawi said that Dubai holding results were excellent in 2013. The profits in 2013 will double those of last year and will exceed 3 billion dirhams. Established in 2004, Dubai Holding is a global investment holding company with interest in 24 countries. Employing 15,000 people from 121 nationalities, Dubai Holding is managed through two business groups, Dubai Holding Commercials Operations Group, DHCOG, and Dubai Holding Investment Group, DHIG.